Did you guys know there is more than one way to wear a plain old button down shirt? Hmm? Hmm? tell from the title we are going to take a plain old button down shirt button down or button up uh some people call it a button down some people call it a button up um i call it a button down leave a comment down below what do you call it do you call it a button down or a button up this one i got from h&m and i have mine in a size six h&m does run a bit smaller that's why i have mine in a size six and it fits just like a small so most of us have a shirt just like this and what we do is we probably bought it to go on a job interview or for a new job and we wear it and we button it down we tuck it into our dress pants or we tuck it into our skirt and that's how we wear it these types of shirts aren't just for the office they can be worn in such cute ways and such cute styles as long as you know how to fold it and tie it and tuck it in you're going to be able to really maximize your usage off of just one plain shirt so i love these shirts i think they make the cutest styles if you guys want to know how i have styled a button down shirt in the past please keep watching so this is just look one. I wanted to give you guys an idea of how this dress shirt looks like in its natural state. So this is how we would all naturally wear it. And this is look two where I tuck in the front of it and I just leave the back of it nice and loose. And I really love this look. It gives your dress shirt a little bit of style but you can still wear it to a formal-ish event. And then this is look number three where I tuck in the back of the dress shirt. So the entire dress shirt is tucked in and I take a little tiny bit and I tuck it back out. And just so you guys are noticing, I am wearing high-waisted pants today, which are very complimentary, especially when you are wearing a dress shirt. Now we are moving to look number four. And so with look number four, I am leaving two buttons buttoned and then I am just taking the back there and I am folding it in and then it's leaving me these two flaps that I'm just going to be tying in a knot and I am going to double knot it just to make sure that it is nice and secure and you leave it like that and it just looks super duper cute so the next look i am just going to take one side of the flap and i'm going to tuck it underneath the middle of my bra and i'm going to take the other side and i'm going to tuck it over and under the middle of my bra and then i'm going to tie it in a knot and this is just going to secure my shirt to my bra so there's not going to be a lot of movement and then i'm going to hide the flaps underneath and then I am going to make sure that the back of my shirt is um, secure. So I'm going to also tuck that and fold that underneath. And there you go. I love, love, love the way this looks. I think it's cute. I think it's sassy. Absolutely love it. So the next look is really really fun it's one of my favorite looks so i have the shirt off my shoulders and i am just gauging where i want to button it so i'm buttoning it right there that's exactly where i want it and then i take the two sides and i tie it into a knot and then i also double knot it as well and then i just you know you're just putting your shirt into place and I'm tucking my bra straps underneath and I button one of the buttons up because I don't want to be showing too too much because this look is already kind of revealing and I absolutely love that look where it's off the shoulder so this is the next look and I just have it buttoned right in the middle the two buttons right there and I take the two flaps and I tie them in a knot and then I tie it in a double knot. I always tie my shirts in double knots. It just feels a little bit more secure. So I'm going to take the sleeves and I'm going to fold them up three times. 
And then I'm going to do the same thing to the other side. So we folding, folding, and folding. And then I am going to push up the sleeves over my elbows. So you can see I am pointing at my elbows. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that the bottom of my shirt is tucked in again to keep the look nice and clean. And I am also going to tuck in the bows and it just makes a huge difference with this look right here. I absolutely love this look. I think it's just so flattering. So the next look is a little bit avant-garde if you may say so. Um, so I just have the shirt backwards. So we're wearing the shirt backwards. I'm grabbing the bottom, making sure it's folded in. And then I'm grabbing the flaps on the back and I'm going to tie it into a knot. So I am double knotting it on the bottom there and I'm looking at the mirror because you can see I'm struggling. It's kind of hard to tie a knot behind your back. So we are tying the knots, making sure it's nice and secure and then we are going to tuck it underneath to hide the two little flaps and then you just see me unhook my bra straps because you would want to wear the shirt like this with a backless bra um, because you want the back to look nice and clean just because it makes such a cute little style as you can see right there with the open back and I just absolutely love it and if you look at the front it just looks super chic and really really cute actually you would never know it's a dress shirt so this next look is so fun it is one of my favorites i am just trying to figure out where i want to button my shirt so you're going to see that one side of the shirt is over my shoulder and the other side of my shirt is on my shoulder and i am not aligning the buttons the button is buttoned one button up if that makes sense so i'm just going to take one side and i am going to fold it over and under the middle of my bra and I'm going to take the other side and I'm going to fold it under and over and then I'm just going to tie a knot to secure my shirt to my bra and then I'm going to hide the two flaps and then I'm going to button one button up and now I'm just adjusting my shirt to my liking. I am hiding my one bra strap that is showing and then I am just um, tucking everything in making sure the bottom of my shirt looks nice and neat and the back of my shirt also looks nice and neat and I am also going to tuck in the collar so you're going to see me right here and I'm showing you right now I'm just tucking in the collar and this is going to create a clean look where you're not going to know that I'm actually wearing a dress shirt you're just going to think that it's like a unique shirt that I'm wearing so I love this it is just so freaking cute it is one of my favorite 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 ways to wear a shirt so yeah absolutely love it love it love it Different. So this can be worn in so many different ways. You can honestly maximize the usage of your plain button down dress shirt. So that was my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys learned something really cool today. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you like these types of videos and you want to see more. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment if you would like and I hope you guys have a wonderful fabulous day and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.